Microsoft Access 2013 Data Normalization. Just what is normalization? Well, normalization just refers to you working through the system of your database so that it is free from any possible anomalies and your queries run as fast as humanly possible. Well, faster than humanly possible, as fast as computer possible. Your normalization should actually be done at the design stage, not retrospectively when looking at a database. Ideally, obviously. So what is normalization? Well, it's things like splitting down the fields into the smallest meaningful denominator. Now that's the important bit, the smallest meaningful denominator. So we would take the name field, if you had a name field, and split it into first name, last name, and title. You may even take a telephone number field and split that into the dialing code and the main telephone number, but only if that makes sense and is meaningful. That's the point of the smallest meaningful denominator. You can go a little bit too far breaking field contents down, but a logical one is name for first name, last name, and title. Address can be broken down to logical parts of first line, second line, town, region, country, zip code. So you just have to think meaningful when you're breaking your fields down into smaller entities. Each table should have a single primary key where possible. So you'll have seen that in our particular examples, we've been adding an ID field and giving it the auto number data type. But really that should only be used if there is no naturally occurring single primary key. We can also remove repeating values of data. We saw this in action earlier with our countries. That was replaced with an ID number. And then we use a lookup table to look up the ID in a separate table to then give us the human text value for that ID. But the ID numbers in place of the repeating values make the queries work faster because numbers are easier for computers to work with. You also need to make sure that any additional data does not cause tables to be restructured. Instead, we would add in a new table and link that table into your main table using the primary key linked to the foreign key. This too we've seen in action with our sales for our customers. So that's database normalization. It's a process really that you would need to have in mind when designing your tables at the very outset of a new database.